Hey everybody, it's normally not the kind of thing I would normally do, but uh, at this point, I really don't give a shit, um, pretty much my rights have been violated, my property has been destroyed, and um, they killed my dog, who am I talking about? The Delaware State Police, the thugs with badges, the guys that come in and kick your doors in, dressed all in like uh, SWAT gear and shit, that's him. They're the ones that beat you up when they get there, hit you a couple extra times, give you a little extra because they know that that's when they can do it. Yeah, they, they do that shit. You don't think they do? I'll show you a video. So on top of it, I wasn't home on the 19th. Uh, the police department calls me and says, hey, they had to see me. I said, that's not a problem. I will be there before 12 o'clock. Next thing I know, my security system lets me know that somebody's in my house. I look, who's in my house? The Delaware State Police in my house. I let them in. Somebody let them in. I didn't let them in. So to me, they broke into my house. Even though I said I was on my way back to see them. Because they wanted to do their uh, sneak up and grab your gun shit. Because what it is, this is all about gun rights and being a victim. So they snack. They come up to my house trying to get the gun. My dog's in the cage. He's in his kennel inside the house. That's where I normally keep him. I guess they were too afraid to go into the house any further than they did, but they did enter my house. I'm going tell you that right now. They did enter my house, and I have it on video. They had no right to be in my house without me being there. They didn't have a search warrant, but they still entered my premises. So then they said, oh, we better go get a search warrant. So they did the next day and go get a search warrant. They didn't come back with the old SWAT team or cert, whatever shit they call themselves now. Kick my fucking door in. My dog's not in the kennel. The dog's not in the kennel because I was running late. And I let my neighbor walk my dog. He didn't want to go in the kennel because he was scared. Because of the shit had happened last night. And then these thugs come back the next day. And kick the fucking door in. And on the video you can see my dog run. He didn't, he didn't try to attack them. He ran. And he cowered in the kitchen behind the table. After they come in and stop. You'll hear one of the officers. Oh just let him go. He's okay. They're not. And then you see the other pig. I say pig because you're a pig. Shoot him and kill him. You're a piece of shit. If I shot your dog, what would you do? You would fucking come to arrest me. Try anyway. You fucking murdered my dog, you fucking pig. I will not forget what you've done. I will not threaten you. Because that's against the law. That's against the laws that you're protecting and serving. But you can bust down my fucking door and steal my property. Then you could go through all my stuff and destroy my house and flip my house like you're a piece of shit. It's disrespectful. And I'm going to disrespect you, drag back. Just all, you, fuck you. Fuck you, motherfuckers. This is what it is. Yeah. Fucking piece of shit. I'll tell you right now. There's no fucking need for what happened to happen. You're a fucking thug-ass bully with a fucking badge is all you are. Take your fucking thug-ass bully badge off and your fucking rest of your shit off and you're just like anybody else. And it ain't how fucking tough you are. It ain't how badass you are. It's about how far you're willing to take shit. I'm willing to see it. Brew. So oh, I guess now I'm in contempt of cop, boy. Shit, here goes my fucking rights out the window. You gonna come fucking shoot me too? I know you want to, because you think I'm the scum of the fucking earth. Well, I'll tell you something, fucking shit-faced fuckers. I was a productive fucking person. I did my fucking job. I worked in EMS, but I watched you fucking cops run the fuck over people like you were fucking, you were fucking gods. Because you wore that badge. You had that fucking um, holier-than-thou attitude. And I watched the shit that you did, and that's what made me change how I felt about you. So fuck you. Fucking piece of shit, motherfuckers. 
Yeah, you guys are a fucking piece of work. The one fucking cop says, I oh, don't shoot him. And then you shot him anyway. You are a piece of shit, you fucking pig. And you all hide behind your little fucking monkey suits and your little fucking facey maskish things because you think you're G.I. Joe. People know who the fuck you are. Are you fucking serious? You really think you're a fucking ninja? It ain't hard to figure out who's who when you pull up in a truck. It says police on it, and it's a uh, what an ex excursion. I wonder who drives that excursion. It ain't hard. See, you're stupid. And then this 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 is this is what really kills me: the mentality of the cop who came up with a fucking bright idea that they're gonna break into a gun safe made of plate steel with a fucking screwdriver, a screwdriver that you stole from my garage. Took in there and then broke and damaged. You, and then you tore my safe up trying to pry into it because you're stupid like that. Then, not only did you get in my safe, you got in my house. Then you got in my safe. And then did you have a warrant for the box you broke into that was in the safe? Nah, I don't think so because you didn't know it was in there. So suck a dick. You broke your own fucking laws. So I'm going to post that video of you guys murdering my fucking dog. I guess after that, you're just going to have to come get me because I'm in contempt. Contempt of cop. Fuck off.